in this video we are going to discuss ROC of a special signal. So, you can see find the ROC of x of n is equivalent to 3 mod less of n. First of all we need to uh, discuss about what is meant by 3 mod less of n, what is the meaning of 3 mod less of n. So, in positive region n is equivalent to positive, in negative axis that is equivalent to negative. So, the meaning of x of n is equivalent to 3 mod less of n is it is equivalent to 3 power n when u of n is there that means positive sided, u of n represent positive sided signal plus it is negative, it is negative, n is negative when it is left sided. How we can represent left sided signal minus n minus 1. If you multiplied minus 1 from 0 to infinity that will become left sided signal. If that is a left sided signal this mod less of n is equivalent to minus n. If this is a right sided signal n is equivalent to positive in left region that is equivalent to negative. How we can represent left and right regions means u of n plus u of minus n minus 1. So, here that means what I am doing is just into 1 this 1 I am writing as u of n plus u of minus n minus 1 that is it. Multiplying u of n plus u of minus n minus 1 will not affect the signal why because this is a discrete 1 dc, dc 1. So, now here I want to discuss the jet transform first because they are asking ROC. To get the region of convergence first we need to get the jet transform of the signal. So, if you consider the jet transform of the signal, so here I am writing this as, so this is in the form of a power n into u of n. So, that is why I am writing as z by z minus a that means z by z minus 3 as this transform and here I am having a 3 power minus n u of minus n minus 1. So, whenever you are having 3 power minus n u of minus n minus 1, I am writing like this, I can write like this also. So, 1 by 3 whole power n u of minus n minus 1 also I can write. So, in this case, so if I consider z transform, if I consider z transform, I will get like this z by z minus 1 by 3, z by z minus 1 by 3. So, here I can write this as so, if I write like this 3 inverse whole power n, 3 inverse whole power n u of minus n minus 1, then this is equivalent to z by z minus 1 by 3, 3 inverse I am writing like z by z minus 1 by 3, here you can take minus. So, this is z transform of your signal 3 mod less of n. I am not talking about z transform, I want to talk about the uh, actual uh, uh, poles and zeros. So, here to write the ROC first we need to discuss about this poles. So, for this for this part of the signal we are having two parts of the signal. For this part of the signal mod z is 3. See the ROC is so is greater than 3. Why? Because mod z is equivalent to 3 by equating denominator to 0 you are going to get your z value. So, z value is 3 whether you need to take greater than or less than that is dependent upon the signal. If the signal is right sided signal you will take greater than. So, ROC is mod z greater than 3. So, now coming to this. So, here z is equivalent to mod z is equivalent to 1 by 3 by equating denominator to 0 you are going to get your z pole that z pole is 1 by 3. So, here we need to consider the ROC as greater than or less than to that pole that can be decided by the signal. This transform came from this left sided signal. So, as that is a left sided signal we will take less than. So, now if you draw the ROC whenever you are having two poles the ROC is the common ROC of two regions. So, we need to consider the unit circle first. So, I consider my unit circle first as a reference and here mod z is greater than 3. What are the poles you are having? You just mentioned that poles 1 by 3 is one pole and here 3 is another pole. So, you just mention that poles and you just draw circle related to that pole. And now 
here i am having roc mod z greater than 3 greater than 3 means so like this this is roc of first one and roc of second one is mod z less than 1 by 3 less than 1 by 3 means so it's below to this there is no common roc so roc there is no common roc for this signal we can't say a perfect roc region of convergence of this signal so here as we are not having common roc here so we can't say the perfect roc for this signal so what you find the roc of x of n means you need to mention like this if if that is a conventional type exam you need to write a statement there is no common roc so we can't specify the roc for this signal so in uh, objective type exams they will give you option there is no common roc like that you need to opt for this answer so like this way you need to solve some problems related to roc